Hello everyone, welcome to Chinese brush painting class, lesson 35. Tiger, mountain tiger. Um, behind me, on my left, you can see uh, a scroll painting I done for uh, a customer in New Zealand. Uh, I take uh, all the rec uh, video record to make this into this class. So uh, you will follow the painting steps, uh, how I did this painting and to do yours. The, um, the handout including a picture of this uh, in, uh, with the class. And uh, you, can, you can make a large copy like a poster and then uh, put it under the rice paper to trace it. Speaking of a uh, tiger, I need I like to talk about uh, uh, the symbolism. Um, tiger is a symbol of uh, power and authority. It's known in Chinese as uh, the king of the jungle or king of forest, uh, the emperor of all uh, beasts and the animals. Tiger is also one of the twelve zodiac animals and probably one of the favorite of uh, the twelve animals in Chinese Zodiac. Uh, if you are born in the tiger year, you will be uh, very happy to do this subject matter. And uh, if you know someone who is born in the year of tiger, you can paint a tiger to please them on their birthday. Tiger is very unique to Asia. Uh, we don't see this uh, in other planet, I believe. Uh, so it's a very Chinese, very Asian. Uh, subject matter or animal to learn and a very favorite uh, uh, subject matter in traditional brush painting um, there are many masters in painting tiger uh, Zhang Da Qian's uh, brother is very famous uh, modern uh, master Zhang San, Zhang San Zi is uh, one of the most famous master and uh, Liu Ji Yu uh, is uh, a very uh, good animal painter. That's what uh, this painting is, uh, uh, the style is, uh, I learned after, uh, Liu Jiyu's style. And uh, I will show you more references in the classroom. Uh, we start from the ink painting on uh, mobile paper with only different tones of ink. Then after that, I washed with the uh, color. So basically, it's a combination of uh, a little bit of gombi in the uh, face and the body, elaborated style, and uh, uh, free style on the background, the rock, the waterfall, and the pine trees are more spontaneous. And some part of the body is very uh, free style. So I used uh, many uh, techniques with uh, water, uh, to get it uh, smearing when I need it and use dry brush to control the smearing if needed. So it's a combination of uh, uh, both elaborated style and uh, freestyle. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the class. Goodbye.